Hello children. Today we are going to learn chapter 4 Tick Tick Tick. This sound related to time. Time is measured by using a clock. A clock has two hands. The shorter hand of a clock is called hour hand. The longer hand of a clock is called minute hand. A clock is divided into 12 equal parts. Do you know how to read the time? We will see that. There are 5 equal divisions between 2 numbers. The total number of divisions are 60. Each division represents minute. One full circle of a clock has 60 minutes. That is 1 hour. Look at the clock. The shorter hand that is hour hand is at 5. And the longer hand that is minute hand is at 12. Now the time is 5 o'clock. Next one. Hour hand is at 4. Minute hand is at 18 divisions from 12. Now the time is 4 hours 18 minutes. 1 hour is equal to 60 minutes. Half an hour is equal to 30 minutes. 1 day is equal to 24 hours. Those 24 hours are divided into two parts. Each part is 12 hours long. These parts are called AM and PM. The first part goes from 12 midnight to 12 noon. And this is AM. It is morning. From 12 noon to 12 midnight. This is PM. It is night. AM that means anti meridian before noon pm post meridian after noon children we have to write am or pm first one i wake up at 6 we wake up in the morning is it am or pm yes it is am write am second one i eat lunch at 1:30 we usually eat lunch after 12 noon so it will be pm right pm children remember in a 12 hour clock each time comes twice in a day reading 12 and 24 hours clock there are two ways to write 24 hours one way is to write am or pm along with the time the second way is to write the time according to the 24 hours. Here we won't write am or pm. 1 o'clock at night is written as 1 colon 0 0. Just like that 2 o'clock at night is written as 2 colon 0 0. Till 12 o'clock in the afternoon it is written as 12 colon 0 0. After 12 o'clock what is the time? 1 o'clock. Yes. But when the time is written in 24 hours format, then the 12 hours of the afternoon are not written as 1, 2, 3 again. Instead of that, they are written as 13, 14, 15, 16 and so on. 12 o'clock at night will be written as 24, 0, 0. If it is 15 minutes past 12 o'clock, then how will we write? 15 minutes past 12 o'clock at night will be written as 0, 0, colon, 15 in the 24 hours format. 1 year is equal to 12 months. 1 month is equal to 30 or 31 days. 1 week is equal to 7 days. Let's recall the month of the year and days of the week. There are different ways by which you can represent the date but the standard format is dd slash mm slash y y y y here each month represents to a particular number january 01 february 02 march 03 april 04 like that here dd is date mm is month 
y y y y is here let me explain with one example 22 june 2020 22 is date june is month 2020 is year write 22 and then what is the number corresponds to the month june that is 06 so write 06 22 Slash zero six slash two thousand twenty, or you can write it in another way. That is twenty two slash six slash twenty. Next, write which date the following stand for. Eight slash zero nine slash two thousand ten. First is date, so write eight. Next is month. which is the ninth month of the year is yes, it is september write september and lastly write 2010 the answer is 8th september 2010 how long will the minute hand take look at these two clocks in the first clock the time is 6:15 and in the second clock the time is 6:45 we have to find out how many minutes will the minute hand take to move from 6:15 to 6:45 shall we count 5 10 15 20 25 30 so the answer is 30 minutes thank you